<laughs> what are you doing here, babe? Hey, boo. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm good, how are you? Yeah, I'm good, thank you. Yeah, oh, I can't believe so you're in. much of you. You're like a climbing thing. Oh, welcome, welcome. Thank you. You're very smart all of a sudden. It's nice to actually see you in clothes. You know each other. Um, yeah. I know a bit about you. Oh, gosh. I know what you are. What am I? You're loyal. Oh, here we go. <laughs> You must know each other well if you call her G. A diminutive's very familiar. Well, yeah. <laughs> Don't make I me laugh. I spent four weeks with this one. And when she tries to kiss you, it's a bit mad. Um, OK, let's not go on to that topic. <laughs> oh. That's still a touchy... <laughs> You're so... <laughs> <laughs> Sit down. So you do know each other well, then? Mm. <laughs> I can't believe you're here. And I can't believe how fit he is. Mm, yes, please. Do you want to sit down? I mean, I'll just chill here. Let's all squeeze. Let's squidge. Oh, there's a new boy on the block. I hope I'm not interrupting anything between Jack and Georgia. Have you not spoken then since... Um, not on purpose, you not spoken. No, we, we, just, just, spoken. we just had different, like... Definitions of a kiss? Life gets in the way, doesn't it? Yeah. So does an awkward who kissed who spat on national television. Safe by the bell. Hello. Hello, Tom. Hello. I've got everybody down here. It's a veritable party. <gasps> of course, yes, you have Jack as well. Well, would you mind just sending the girls up, please? Yes, certainly. Excellent. Thank you, Tom. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Girls, be ready for you. See you later. Oh. Nice to meet you. See you soon. Oh, of course. Georgia and Jack. There's a little thing there. Well, there was a little thing there. Interesting. <laughs> I was not expecting that. People, I do, can you imagine what I thought? Jack, I was like, oh, you're joking. Oh, no way. He's a lovely boy, though. Yeah, he seems really nice. Yep, that's the wrong room. Will you stop prattling on about Jack and get in there, please? Oh. You like Hello. the knife? What's Look, I thought I'd be polite. I know. Look at this. How you guys are looking you know good. Oh, thank you. Georgia has a history with her boy Jack, so I want to hear her side of the story. So, what happened? We went out, um, I had a few Proseccos, <laughs> and, uh, yeah, maybe kissed the boy. I actually don't remember it, I'll be honest. <laughs> Some convenient memory loss there. So is there still a thing between the two of them? No. No. OK. What are you like as a boyfriend? When I'm in a relationship, that's it. <laughs> like, I, there's, no, there's no fooling around, like... Mm. OK, so you're, you're in it for the long haul. Yeah. I'm happy dating girls. That's never been a problem. It's just, are you with me for me? Yes. Right. Because I've got plenty of people I can do things with, but I haven't really got anyone to do nothing with. Okay. That was deep, man. I'm free to do nothing with you. What you just said was the single most profound statement I've ever heard a celebrity say. Sam, the wrestling fan, is doing everything in his power not to show Charlotte his pile driver. What would your wrestling name be? Let's make I, one now, yeah, and you have to one. stick you to it. You have to help me, like, because okay. I literally haven't thought of one, and okay. I've been thinking for ages, like, what can it be? So you have to help me think of one. Beautiful, look, nice eyes. What? That's terrible, Sam. That's, okay. like, really terrible. Right. Come out in the ring with me. Yes! You know what? There's and then I'll teach you to fire breathe, and then you can come out fire breathing behind me. you fire breathe as well. Charlotte, be careful what you wish for. That's how I practised in the shower. I try and do it with that, but it's... Yeah. <gasps> do it. Would you actually want me to yeah. do it? Yeah! Go on! Let's do it together. Oh, no, OK. <laughs> well, that's one way to answer the spit or swallow question. Who knew Sam spat? We're so cool. Are you, though? <laughs> yeah, you are. Oh, my God. Please do your T-Rex impression. Sam, you can't do this. Remember what you've been told. Remember what you've been told. You have to do the T-Rex impression. Don't do it, Sam. I shouldn't be doing impressions. That's kind of the old Sam. The new... Oh, what's the difference between old Sam and new Sam? The new Sam's more mature. A bit more like, hey. What? <sighs> I get a kiss on the cheek for If you do that, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. I actually love it. Well, at least someone does. Your face looks precisely like a T Rex. Yep, that's being taken up the arse by a Triceratops. I get a kiss on the cheek, though. Yes. Now you've got lipstick on your face. Oh, it's great. Yeah. Badge of honour.
Sam's taking on board the agent's advice and avoiding talk of marriage with the art of distraction. So what do you think to Pete and Catherine? Do you think they're a good match? You know what? Let's go and see them. Mm -hmm. Let's yes, go and crash their date and make yeah. it really shitty and awkward. <laughs> oh, they'll love that. Let's go, let's just go and be like fucking T Rexes in front let's of them. Oh my god, let's do T Rex <laughs> walks. Do walks. Yeah. Let's do T Rex yeah. walks. What, what was that, meerkats? Oh. Ah. Someone's opened a packet of banter. <laughs> Isn't it? That's the best <laughs> one. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Sorry, I've just. Why have I started doing this? Yeah. You're, You're off joining on me. in. No. I've just He's done a dinosaur impression. Yeah. Oh my god. Bloody hell, I've only been hanging out with this geezer for one day, and I'm the one turning into a wallow. <laughs> We've had such a good time. Yes. Those kids. Get on the We can kiss. That's it. Do what the big boy did, Sam. Game, set, and match. Until next time, Samuel. Yeah. Bye. Samuel, come on, Sam. Oh, boy. <laughs> Flat call, Sam. <laughs> I got a case. So, I mean, we're basically, you know, sexually active. Um, could I have an espresso martini, please? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Can I just get a uh, uh, water with ice, please? Yeah. It's all right. You're getting water with ice? That's what I drink. Will you have yeah. a shot of vodka in it if you want? If you want a shot. Two shots with vodka, espresso martini, and water with ice, yeah? Yes, please. Or you forget the water. Are you going to do a shot of vodka? Right, I will have the one, but no more. And that is, and I, I mean that. He'll also have a double peer pressure and coke, please, Libby. How much would you describe yourself? Just quickly, go on. I'm quite like a big character. I say how it is, and I ain't afraid to say how it is. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, I'm the same. Everyone thinks I'm a dick, but a nice dick. So if everyone wants. To... Do you know what? That's me. Yeah, that is me, Dan. I'm me. nice, but I'm naughty. Yeah, same. Yeah, people who describe me as a dickhead, but probably the nicest dickhead that they've ever met. Yeah, a yeah. bit like me. If they want a. Yeah, well, I mean, I don't know that. I'm not going to go, yeah, you're a dickhead. Can I? But a nice well, one. You're a nice but one. if you're telling me that you're a nice dickhead, I will agree and say yes. Yeah. Do you like plain rice? What? Just plain? Boiled rice? Well, you are quite plain. You've just described me as a piece of rice. I've never had that before. What do you think about me? A uh, bit ricey, mate. I've never had that ever in my whole life. But you ain't you ain't the um, egg fried, you're the plain rice. Yeah, just plain rice. You're a plain I think it's been like Singapore noodle, you know, a little bit thin, but a bit spicy. <laughs> I have a question for you. Go, oh, go on, I like question time. I've always wondered this. Go on. What do you actually do? Ah, bravo, my son. The question everyone wants to ask a celeb on this show. Um, do the errands. Errands. I check the letterbox, do the food shop. Clean in the toilet. All the boring stuff. No, I don't clean the toilet, I have a clean. So in summary, fuck all. When it comes to men, I'm quite traditional. The man should, like, look after the lady. Right. But there's a fine line between kind of being quite manly and domineering in that in a good sense and then in a bad sense. I like a bit of a geezer. Someone I can have a laugh with, yet someone that I've got respect for. And Funny like geezer, that. best mate, dad figure. That's what I just got from that. Dad figure? That's not what I said. No wonder I don't let my guard down. Right, okay. So what do you think of me so far then? I think you're really different. Different is a nice way of saying I don't fancy you. Your uh, eyes are very, aren't they? They, like, pop out of your skull. Is that an insult, like, your eyes are too big for your face? <laughs> they look at you. Yeah, that's the primary function. I'm wondering if it's the more of that you drink, the meaner you get. I was wondering whether to cap the drink or not. No, no, I'm just banter. Oh, it's just banter, is it? Your eyes are popping out your fucking head. Oh, bit of banter. <laughs> You're joking me. <laughs> Katie, Hello. how are you? Hang on, how does he know her name? <laughs> nice to see you. Nice to see you again, Stranger. you right? Yeah. How you been? Good, how are you? Well, this is weird. You are having a laugh, isn't ya? I used to mess about uh, 10 years ago. Well, I think we all know what that means. I had no idea who I was going on a date with. They didn't tell me a name, they didn't tell me nothing. Nothing? Nothing. Like so it was a complete, idea. complete blind date. And look who it turns out to be a really good surprise, yeah. Good. You look really good. So what's been going on with your dating life? Um, serial or dating? It's gone back to being how it was ten years ago. So serial or data? Yep, he's just completed Tinder, actually. OK. It's not worked out too well. No. Hence the reason okay. I joined the agency. Anyway, fuck me. Is that an order or a question? What's going on with you? Why are you still single at 29? I don't know. I feel like I attract the wrong people. I always get the DMers of, like, the... 
I was going to say so Zed, Zed the... Listers, but... <laughs> She's got you there, Peter. It's all good. Um, good. Yeah. Did you just send this me off? <laughs> no. I just get, like, attract like, True, the wrong but people. Arsh. Yeah. You got all the Muscle Marys after. I'm fairly sure they're after something else altogether, Pete. I like muscly guys. Oh, you're fucked, My description you? was tall, dark, tanned, cheeky. You've got three of them, you're not tall. You can try and be tall. Same like lying down, so I wouldn't worry about oh, it. Oh, wow. So, <laughs> God, he's smooth. So three out of four, I'll take that. OK. Genuinely, you haven't changed. Like, 10 years, whatever it is, you still look as beautiful as you did like, when you were 20. He could write a book with these lines. That's cute. But obviously, fuck off. <laughs> But obviously, like, you're 29, like, you're similar age to me. For a long time, I felt under so much pressure to be with someone and get married and have kids and stuff. I'm like, do you know what? Do you want to get married? I'd really rather get married than have kids. But I want to live my life with that person first. Like, all the fun holidays, like, have all that fun time. That's, I, I swear to God, that's exactly what I say to people. That's you know, it's one of the things. I want to get married. Bloody hell, we want the same thing. This is mad. I'm into this, I like her. So this is really funny because the agents have told me that I'm not open enough about whether or not I want to see someone again. But I will be open. I will go and see maybe. Why is he speaking like a killer in EastEnders? I think my diary's free for you, yeah. I definitely want to go on another date with her. She's a soul. She's got a decent bit of chat. Let's drink up and go, yeah. As much as I would love to continue this Your voice gets date. more husky as the day goes on, doesn't it? Yeah, the drunker I get, the husky I get. Yeah, that's better. Does it turn you on? Yeah, a lot. I'm never sucking on a strepsil ever again. I think today I'm just going to be a bit more relaxed. <laughs> we got to see what she's like with these balls. <laughs> He's hand hunting you. And here she comes now. Hi, hey, hey, how are you? Good. Would you like a drink? Oh, she's the waitress. Oh, my days, the waitress is fit. I wouldn't mind her being my date. Hey. Hello, how, how are, are you, darling? I'm Carol. How, how are you, darling? How are you? I'm Jack. good. You all right? Well, no. Thank you. I knew you darling. Take a seat, bro. She's cute, not my usual type, but I'll take the agent's advice and give it my best shot. Your accent, your accent, your accent. Is he malfunctioning? Yeah, I'm from the uh, west of Ireland. Did you know who you were meeting? Yeah, yeah, What yeah, did they say? Yeah. Can you understand me? You know what it is? Can I move this in? If you talk really fast, yeah, I might need some help, so I'm not going to okay. lie. Carol's a right laugh, and there could be a connection there, but I just can't understand a word that she's saying. Have you heard of Ireland? Who? The sport jack, not puking. Curling? That one? No. What's that one? What is that? Hockey? Curling. I'm doing curling over here. Curling? You know what? You brush the floor and you make it shiny so they can. You're talking about cleaning. No, Carol. Boss man Jack just gets bit hyped by them winter sports shit. Okay, here. okay, shh. You don't know what you're talking about. That was a madness. Yeah, I was confused at the start. True for a drink. Okay, you All go right. first. Are you Irish? Crack on. <laughs> Are you going to freeze them? Thinking about that waitress again. Has someone ever sucked your toe? Has someone ever sucked my toe? <laughs> I feel like they have. From that answer, they have. Yeah. Yeah, they have. Come on, yeah. then. What are you talking about? A drinker. Cheers. There we go. I think, I think the date went well. I think that you're a nice girl. I think your head's screwed on. I think there's a lot about you. I don't know if there is a massive spark or connection. And I think the only thing I can be is completely honest. Yeah. I never get mad at someone that's honest. We just weren't right for each other, and that happens. Hopefully, I might meet someone that's good for me, and he'll meet someone that's good for him. Funny you should say that. That was really <laughs> I think Jack's already got someone in mind. Oh. <laughs> I'm honest with you. Yeah. I'd rather get to know you more. Oh, cool. I'm free. If you're down for I that. mean, not right now, I have work. Of but course, later. Of course. <laughs> but if we could sort something out, if I could take you out on a date yeah. or take your number, I'd really appreciate that. Sure. Oh, I'm Kate, by the way. Nice to meet you, Jack. <laughs> Love it to meet you. I didn't even take your name. <laughs> Shit. What's the name? That's right, Kate. Love it to meet yeah. you, darling. I'll call Amazing. you. Amazing. It was All nice right? meeting you. And you, darling. Take care. Have a good night. Sit down. Bye. Oh, so, why is the waitress so attractive? Her name's Kate. I wouldn't want to lead Carol on when. I think maybe the waitress was more my type. Kate, her name's Kate. I've asked her out. She said, yeah, I've taken her number. So we'll see what happens. Well, take her on a date and hope she doesn't go off with a waiter.